Hey everyone, so I am back with another video and I'm here today with my sister Krista and I decided that we should do a video called Makeup I Stole From My Sister because she steals all of my makeup. Now I don't have any makeup to show you but she has a ton because she stole it all. In my defense, if I steal something from you and you don't notice that it's gone within a month or two, it should be mine to keep. You obviously don't need it. But I could say the same for you. You have a lot of makeup up there that you don't use. I know, well, so steal it. Alright, I'm gonna start. <laughs> so the first thing that she stole from me is my Naked 2 Urban Decay palette. She's had this for a good, what, at least six months. No, what, well, yeah. But she took my Naked 1 palette in exchange because she lost hers. Because I was saying to Krista earlier, I felt like it was okay because if I know she has her Naked 2 and I have her Naked 1, then I feel like, or she has my Naked 2 and I have her Naked 1, I feel like I have all three in my possession. I know where they are. I don't like that I'm missing my Naked 1 and have no idea what happened to it. So why did you steal this one from me? I stole it because I like how it's basically neutral but not boring. And I, I don't know, I found a combination that works, and I stick with it, and most days I teach, I just quickly put the combination together, and I'm set. She does have the same look every single day. I've got complimented on it at school. By kids? And a teacher. <laughs> By, like, kindergartners? No, I've been told, you're so pretty. By kindergartners? No, like, grade three or four. She's a teacher, in case you didn't know. She looks <laughs> small, but she teaches. I'm even sitting on a pillow. <laughs> <laughs> she did have to because that made me look like a giant that was going to eat her. <laughs> okay, so the next product she stole from me is another good palette, and it's my Lorac. Lorac. We have a fight over whether it's Lorac no, or Lorac. No, the fight is whether she says it. Sometimes she pretends she's all snooty. Oh, my Lorac palette. And other times she's like, where's my Lorac palette? <laughs> yeah, and then have she, a country you know, accent. No, but basically you're like, where's my Lorac palette? And then I'm... And then you say, it's Lorac, but you change it. I always say Lorac. This is such a messy palette. Yeah. Again, I think I stole this. She taught me a look or two, and <laughs> when we were on... When did we use this? On Nashville? Yeah, I think we brought it to yeah. Nashville with and us. And I used it, and then I just liked my look that I did. So She I does that it. a lot, stealing looks. I don't know, you can't tell us because we're not <laughs> close enough to the camera, but we are wearing the exact same makeup today because I came upstairs, and she was like... I want that makeup, so I had to walk her through how I did it, and she has the same lip products, same cheeks, same eyes, everything is the exact same, because she doesn't want to be like her big sister. Okay, next, I didn't even know you had this, L'Oreal Nutrisleek, I remember, do you remember when I said I had no oil, and I like didn't know what happened to any of my oils, did you have this at that time? And you but didn't... I use it, I threw you down a different one. But you didn't tell me that you had my oil when I had No, to... that wasn't the one that you're missing. I don't Not missing. I didn't have oils, and I ended up having to go out and buy some. Okay, well. This one and she had this the whole time. This has been like a year. She can deal. <laughs> Anyways, I like this. I put in my hair after I come out of the shower. I don't know what it is. It's L'Oreal Nutrisleek Precious Oils. Um, it's a hair oil. oil. Just smooths it out when I put it in. So the next item is from Matrix, and it's a heat-resist iron tamer. And you know what's so funny? Because this was sent to me, and I don't even think I got to try it. And but she, this is the thing, she let me use it, but then I kept it. Yeah, because I was like, I think I got something from Matrix that would have been good for, like, because remember oh, I said I need a heat protectant, <laughs> and you had this the entire time. It's in my daily routine, the oil and this, I can't give it up now. So the next product she stole of mine is one that I actually said she could have, and it's the Laura Mercier Silk Cream Foundation, and we both bought it at the same time, and for mm -hmm. some reason, this just like oxidized on me like crazy. I would be orange by the end of the day, so I did say that she could have mine. Yeah. But that saved you a buttload of money, yeah. so remember that. Well, I'm still going to get another one, and I'm almost out. I use this every day. Remember that. If you're ever being mean to me and I say, Laura Mercier. Then just remember, my sister's so nice, she let me have a $45 foundation for free. That she doesn't use, so I might as well put it to good use. Okay, next up is a blush from Dior, and this blush I absolutely love. It's one of their Dior Cheat Creams, and it was out, I think, last summer, because I remember we took this to Nashville, right? Yeah. I haven't seen this thing since last summer, <laughs> to be honest. But I really like it. I don't really like cream blushes, but this one's good. It doesn't. It's not hard to apply, and it's a nice, It's like one of those, pink. like, mo moussey textured yeah, blushes. I don't even think the company makes these anymore, to be honest. So I better keep that in my little paws, really. <laughs> Next up is another product that I let her have, or let her steal from me, and it is the Benefit, the professional um, primer that's supposed to help minimize pores. I really like this, but I've just 
been using a different primer, like not any reason why I don't like it. I just I like try it. new things. So she's the primer I use every day. It's almost out. And I don't have any more for you to steal. We'll You're gonna have to find you. another primer to steal, probably. Maybe yeah. the one you used today. Yeah. No. Okay, next up is something that I actually found in her drawers this morning and then put it on because I really, really like it. So I'm wearing it on my lips. It looks crazy. You're wearing it on your lips. And it is one of the Tarte Lip Surgeons pencils that came with the Holiday Collection a couple years ago. And this is in the shade Perky. I have one complaint. If I'm going to steal something for it from you, I prefer if the lid's not broken. <laughs> Because when I put it in my purse and the lid's cracked, it always comes off and it gets all over. Things. Yeah, there's no lid now. No, it completely no lid. So cracked. So next time, please get, let me steal a product that does not have a broken lid. But I might want this one back for no, you. No, 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 no. Do you actually use this on a regular basis? Yeah. I but guess. I really like the shade that I'm wearing right now. We'll share it. We'll share it. You're upstairs. I'm never going to come get it. We'll see. And then the last two products that she has are from Buxom, and I did let her... Well, no, I think you stole these, but then I said you could keep them, because yeah, I know she know uses I them. them. them then and they are the... I don't even know what these are called. Big and Healthy Lipsticks. So they're like a lipstick pencil. They're like kind of like a chubby lipstick pencil, and they feel amazing on your they lips. They feel like tingly, like minty. Like tingly, minty, smooth. They're really, really nice. Um, not at all drying at all. Hmm. And why did you take these? For all those reasons I just said. Yeah, I like them. Some lipsticks, I don't like the feeling of them where they don't seem to stay. This one seems like it goes on and it stays. It doesn't feel like it's going to smear all over you. And I like the feeling of it. It's not and really she's dry. horrible at applying <laughs> lipstick. That just reminded me that you said smear all over me. <laughs> if she doesn't have this pencil formula, girl can't put on lipstick. I made her be my um, lip model for Worst some Milani lipsticks life. last year. And it was like... The lipstick was all over your face by the end of it. Like, you could not apply that lipstick. I did not like to... those lipsticks. So, to finish off the video, um, I told her I wanted her to go through my collection and pick out three things that she would love to steal from <laughs> me so that I have, like, Basically, my eye. I know, like, I can keep these things under lock and key so I know, crap, Crystal wants to steal those things from me. So, take us through what you took or want to take. The first thing I'm going to steal, <laughs> that's how I say I'm going is her Makeup Forever Pro Finish Powder. Whenever we go on trips together, if we pack makeup, we always pack this because I can't open it. Because it's a good powder. I don't know, it's not, it doesn't leave like a chalky finish. It's but it's not like a translucent powder. No. Like there's definitely coverage to it. It's supposed to be like actually a powder foundation, but we just used it as a powder. <laughs> the next thing, I might steal, probably. Next thing I might steal is this, Lise, how do you say it? Lise Watier Le Max. Lise Watier. <laughs> <laughs> this is why she shouldn't have my makeup. If you can't pronounce it, you can't take it. This Lise Watier, no, this Liz Watier palette. The reason, again, Alicia showed me a look with it. <laughs> I like to repeat <laughs> those looks. I know what to do. If I walk her step by step, exactly. like, this goes on your crease. Now take this brush and put this on the outer, like, one third of your eye. And she liked the way I described it. I said that pink and blue palette. Yeah, okay, <laughs> let's open the palette again. <laughs> when she was looking for this to show you, like, what she wanted to steal, she was like, that pink and blue one that I used a couple weeks ago. There's no blue in this. There's a gray. The gray looked blue when it's on. No, it didn't. It looked like gray when it was on. So this is a new palette that they have out for spring, but they're going to make it part of their permanent collection, and it's Lay Matte, and it's really good formula. Like, mm -hmm. I really like these eyeshadows a lot. So that was the second thing I have to keep under lock and key. And last, the last thing is her Hourglass palette. I really like these. The ambient lighting palette that came yeah. out at Christmas. Because it's a nice highlighter, and if you put it on over top of the powder, it just gives you, like, a... Luminous glow. glow. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm surprised actually because I have the other single of that that I don't really use that often. I'm surprised you haven't stolen that from me. And then I just got an ambient lighting blush, which I haven't let you try yet because I, I feel. It today. Oh, did you? I put it a little bit on top of this. Oh. And you don't want to steal it though? Maybe. You told me just to pick three. <laughs> <laughs> she would go through the whole room and take everything. That is it for our makeup I stole from my sister video. We are going to be doing a second video, which will probably be up after this. And I'm curious to find out what that video is about because I didn't plan it. She did it all. Apparently, it's a whole 
question and answer thing of how well I know my makeup. So thanks so much for watching and we will see you again soon. Bye!